getting emotional, you guys. It's so awesome to see, man. Mr. Leon Swag is holding a piece of GTS history. I've been selling off some of our GTS championships on YouTube to, you know, help fund the show, help keep it going through these tough times. And, you know, we're doing it for you. We're doing it for us. We're doing it for everybody. But it's been tough. What's up, everybody? It's Grim. Thanks so much for joining me here on today's video. Well, you guys know I've been doing a job hunt. And, you know, things have been changing big. I've just been live streaming, actually, all morning on TikTok doing a cooking show. And I was actually having so much fun, you guys. Like, what is happening? This is like the ultimate change right now. Bro, your face is kind of gross. Why? It just it's, reminds it's... me of when you were a teenager. <laughs> it's exactly what I look like. Look, see in your picture. All right, so why are you shaving your face? For the job. Did you not watch my vlog? Everybody else did. I finally got views. Why? I'm just reminding everybody. I know. <laughs> I got Jay Evans a job driving a truck. I'm not. I don't want to drive a truck anymore. Yeah, I used to drive for Coca-Cola, you guys, back in the day. I'm still a driver. I drove for them. I drove yeah. for other people, and I still drive truck now. That's the last thing. Like, I, I just feel like I'm way too talented and have leveled up. I mean, no offense. I've leveled up from that. Like, I've ran a successful wrestling channel, a successful wrestling promotion for 10 years. That's, like, unheard of You're on YouTube. you to put me down that I'm a truck driver, right? Never. Right. I was one for 15 years, and I kicked ass at it. But then I changed and moved on to something. All right, so and I feel like I want to stay there. All right, so you had a good, successful show. So why are you not moving it on the A-dubs and, and WWEs? I, I, I don't know. I, I think of, like, wrestling in the ring as, like, WWE or AEW wrestler might be... Too stupid! I'm not talking about getting your ass in the ring. I'm talking about behind the scenes, man, writing this stuff. Why ain't you calling the shots? Producer, all right? Storyline. You got friends. Text them. I know you got Jeff Jarrett's phone number. I know you got Jericho's phone number. Sammy Guevara. I mean, hell, I could throw a shot out to some of my friends. Matt, I know, I know Matt Bloom. The, the NXT coach, is, remember they were going to offer me an NXT tryout. I could text him too. Bro, I'm sure you can get in touch with so many different people. Would they hire me? I don't know. Well, you got a resume at 10 years. I do. I have a fantastic resume and I would be an asset to anybody. Damn right. But you know what? Maybe not because my confidence is being killed right now. Jimmy Controversy is kicking our ass with Pro Wrestling Venom. Like this is a shoot. This is for real. Like all of a sudden GTS's future is actually threatened because Jimmy Controversy is this close to catching us in views. Well... Like, all of a sudden, in three or four weeks. I don't know where he even found the workers. One of the best ways to help GTS Wrestling and this channel is to, like, watch all the playlists. You know, like, click on a playlist, let it play. Let it play while you're taking a nap. Let it play while you go to sleep. Let it play while you're working. You know, listen to the vids, watch the playlists. It gives us the watch time, the views, and the ad rev to keep this going. More importantly, it suggests it to your friends. Yeah! I'm dead serious, you guys. I have to grow this beard back. I mean, it's already back. It's already stubble. It's growing in. I am walking into LA Fitness right now. And why am I going to LA Fitness? Well, I'm going to meet with my own personal trainer to find out how I can get into this business. Apparently, you need some kind of certificate or something. I thought, you know, the fact that like I accomplished was 110 pounds, you'd be like, well, you should teach other people how to do that rather than sit in a class for six weeks and read a book. But this is the world and it makes no sense to me. And, and so now I'm screwed. How am I ever going to become a personal trainer if I don't have this this license or whatever? It's my All right, you guys. So talk to my personal trainer. He said that yeah, I'm going to need a six-week certificate. To complete and it's gonna cost a couple hundred bucks so that's not bad i can do that but it's gonna take me a couple of weeks i need money now why didn't i think of this sooner before i had no money planning is so important you guys when you're trying to go through your life if you don't plan you're planning to fail and that's exactly what i did i failed to plan i said ah I'm funny i'll always have an audience gts wrestling kicks ass my vlog channel i have channels i have tiktoks i'm everywhere and I get good views everywhere. But all of a sudden, in today's new economy, it's not enough. And now I'm scrambling to come up with the cash. We're only in the Christmas season, and this is bad, you guys. So yes, I have all my stuff on eBay. If you guys wanna go check that out. And I'm gonna keep hustling. This isn't gonna stop me, okay? I talked to those people last night about the private investigator thing. It's pretty cool, but it's still very, very new. It's a brand new company. They haven't really been established yet. 
and I'm like scared that I might work for them and like not get paid. You know what I mean? One of the things I really screwed up, you guys, is not being ready. And I learned that from Matt Cardona, Zack Ryder. You know, that's his catchphrase. Always ready. And you know what I'm not? Always ready. And what do you mean not always ready? Well, I had a shot to join WWE. Matt Bloom invited me to the Performance Center to try out for WWE in 2018, but I wasn't ready. I was out of shape. I couldn't wrestle for more than two, three minutes without getting out of breath. How am I ever gonna make it in the WWE, right? I wasn't ready. And right now I'm not ready either because like I need this certificate to become a personal trainer and it's gonna take six weeks when the course starts in four weeks, so actually 10 weeks, but I need money now and I'm not ready. So I didn't plan. And if you don't plan, you plan to fail. No, the line is failure to plan is planning to fail. And right now I'm failing. I need to get it together, you guys. I gotta get my body together. I gotta get my brain together. And I gotta get my bag together. I'm gonna put this big belly business out of business. And I'm gonna put GTS back in business. Good morning, everybody. I just wanna vlog this experience because today I'm starting a brand new cooking show live stream on TikTok, and I'm really excited to share it with all of you. So uh, here we go. Let's do this. Thank you for joining me on this new journey. Thank you for hitting that like button. Thank you for supporting this. You guys are the best. Alexa, play WWE LA Night theme. I couldn't find that on Amazon Music. What? What? So I said, well, I'll show you guys. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, it'll help me reduce how much I have to spend eating out on my healthy meals. And I can show you guys how to make bowls. So, you know, I can't make all of my food every day, every week. I just that? don't have the time. Exhausting. I told you, you should pick small things. Just do one thing at a time. Yeah, I was gonna do the, the, the whole, bro, I was gonna do the whole meal prep thing. You can't, you gotta break it up, bro. It's a lot of work. Yeah. I mean, you know, I could probably do it a lot faster if I wasn't trying to talk and explain. That's what I'm saying. The thing is you have to talk and film cooking the food. And yeah, it's a lot. Because I th I did this a couple times, remember? Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, it is a lot of work. But guess what? That was fun. Oh, it's a lot of fun, I yeah. Let's do it more. Can we do these more? Yes, please. Okay, maybe we could do like a live stream here on the YouTube channel. Would yeah. You guys that's like good that? Too. Guys, let me know in the comments below. And if you want to watch the full live stream, um, I'm putting, I'm archiving all the TikTok live streams on our Patreon, which the link will be in the description. It's only a dollar to subscribe. But, you know, I figure we got a couple hundred people. That'll help me pay a couple hundred bills. Yeah, and then you guys could see all the the comments all and the stuff. All the comments, right, all the backstage stuff, that, you know, that goes on. Because the, the vlog is just what I edited. But the, the live stream is everything. Even yep. the cringy stuff that sometimes comes out of my mouth. <laughs> Did I say anything bad? That's what I no. always... No, you were good. Okay. You were fired. I, 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 I always wonder that, like... You know, I don't say... I don't talk in my real life in ways that would get me canceled. Like, I really don't. Yeah. All right, yeah, interesting, interesting. Yes, I'm excited. Okay, thank you so much. All right, see you then. Wow, you guys. Okay, so I just started filming. I just started turning the camera on because something was just happening and my heart started pounding out my chest. Okay, so the whole personal training thing, we said, you know, not probably not gonna work out, you know. But guess what? It might work out because one of their clients is a huge fan of mine. He's local and he signed up. He said, I want to be a personal trainer. I saw Grim on the vlog on the YouTube and I wanted that guy to be my trainer. And they're like, oh, he doesn't work here. And then he was like, well, maybe he should because I want to hire him. And they said, no, said, oh, corporate. But guess what? So the guy said, well, you know what? You're an idiot. How about I pay Grim myself out of my own pocket to, to that man. And then we can come work out here. And they said, okay. And they said, we're allowed to film. So I got clearance. I got the clearance to film in the Planet Fitness. I got clearance. I got a client that I'm actually being paid to train. This is so exciting, you guys. I got a job. I got a job. I got a job. And he, I can start. As soon as he's ready to go to the gym, he, we can start. Are you guys hyped for this? Let me know in the comments below. I'm like beaming right now. I, my confidence has been shot. You guys see even in the earlier clips, I just, man, see, this is what I'm saying, man. You just, you never give up. That's what I'm saying. You can do this, guys. I just know it. I just, this is great. Things are starting to already turn around. Because all I got to do is you get up, you put in the work, 
and, and you put out good and good comes back. And this is proof, you guys. I got work, I got a job. I got a job. I got a job. I'm going to work. And you know what? I'm going to work as a personal trainer and I'm going to take this man that is a fan of mine that wanted me to be his personal trainer. I'm going to teach him, I'm going to train him, and I'm going to make him a new man. We're gonna fix this dude's life. And, and you guys can follow along. I'll put it all here. This, this is like a private thing. We're allowed to vlog in the Planet Fitness. He's my fan, he wants to be on my channel. And he's gonna pay me to train him. Hire me. <laughs> you want me to train you? Hire me. <laughs> this is exciting, you guys. My heart is pounding at my chest right now. I am so excited. One like equals one prayer. <laughs> All right. Um, thank you for watching. Please like the video. Leave a comment. Subscribe for more. Tap the bell. Turn on notifications. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below, guys. I, I, share a beautiful story of when you got good news and when your life was going to turn around. You know? Because we've, we've all been put against that wall. We've all had our backs up against the wall. We all said, no, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Mm, 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 mm. You fight back. You don't give up. You fight to your last breath. You don't go down without a fight. You don't go quietly into the night. Today, we are canceling the apocalypse. And if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it. Yeah. Sorry. Got a little excited.